Hi, and welcome to our video on exponential form as multiplication, as repeated multiplication. And that's really what it is, so it's a great way of saying it. It's not repeated addition, but multiplication. And, and that's really important to take with us. So let's look at this problem and try to think about what this really means. So in this question, Avery is comparing two expressions. Here's the first expression. It's 8 to the third. They call that an expression, again, because there's no equal sign there. It's just a little, little term. And the second expression is 3 to the fifth. They want to know which expression is greater. Um, so it, often students will rush and say, well, 8 to the third is 24, because 8 times 3 is 24. But that's, that's not what this is saying. This is saying 8 repeated as a multiplication three times. And what's that? Well, 8 times 8 is 64. Times 8 is what? Well, I think of 8 times 60, which is 480, plus 8 times 4, which is 32. And that equals what? That equals 512. So 8 to the third power is 512. Pretty big number. Let's see 3 to the fifth. Now, I think this will be larger because the exponent is two orders higher than 8 to the third, and the exponent really matters. It really affects the growth of the number. So let's try this. 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. Now, 3 times 3 is 9, and then times 3 times 3 times 3. 3 times 3 over here is 9. So now I have 9 times 3 times 9. What's 9 times 3? It's 27 times 9. What's that? Well, 9 times 20 is 180. 9 times 7 is 63. So altogether, it's 243. So even though the exponent was larger, it wasn't large enough to be greater than 8 to the 3rd. So 8 to the 3rd is greater. Now, if it was 3 to the 6th power, what would happen? Well, then you take 243 and multiply it by another 3. And we get, I think, 600... 3 times 200 is 600, plus 3 times 40 is 120. So that's 720 plus 3 times 3, which is 9. It would be 729 if it was 3 to the 6th, and then that would be bigger. But it wasn't. It was 3 to the 5th, so it was, in fact, smaller. Just be careful. Remember that um, 8 to the 3rd and, and, and numbers in this form don't mean this is the not equal sign 3 times 8. They also don't mean to add the numbers repeatedly. What they do mean is to multiply the numbers, the base, this number right here is called the base, the amount of times that the exponent asks. So here we're multiplying 8 out 3 times because the exponent is 3. Alright, and there are many other fun videos on this topic. I hope you enjoy it.